Hello YouTube and welcome back. Today uh, I'm going to be doing the uh, Metal Tag 2022 for the Rock Scout. Okay, and he has 20 questions. And uh, I will start with uh, your favourite release for 2021. Well, a favourite release for 2021 will have to be uh, this album, the debut album by Knight, um, out of Germany. And they are a blackened speed metal band, and this is their debut. And this was at least last year on Dying Victims Records. Okay, question two. A band you discovered old and new in 21. Well, Knife. Also, uh, Cherokee, which you are listening to right now. This is a German um, hard rock band very much influenced in the 70s style of hard rock. Show an album with an outstanding vocal. Well, that would have to be, I don't have it here, it have to be uh, Bob Walls with uh, Ronnie James Dio. Question four. Uh, show a gap filler. Um, I don't have any gap fillers, so I can't show any of that. Uh, question five. Show a cheap pickup from 2021. Uh, again, I don't have anything with that question. Your favorite, question six. Your favorite artwork from a new release. Well, I've got two. I do like uh, that artwork. Cherokee, black and gold cover. I think it's really cool. And I also would have to go with Knife. Love the artwork on that one. Uh, that's it for that one. Okay. A favourite track from 2021. Okay, and that would have to be the first release from uh, the new Flotsam and Jetsam, and that would be Grace for Impact. So it's a really good, fast, heavy, sort of speed melody type track. So Flotsam and Jetsam, Grace for Impact. Okay, question. Eight, a song becoming an earworm. Um, this is from an, an older album. Again, it's from the Mob Rules CD, and that would have to be the song Voodoo. Okay, question nine. Two LPs destined to be culled from your collection. With me, I don't uh, um, buy albums that I won't listen to. So, I don't have anything I would call. Question 10. A band you have gone on, gone off on. Uh, nothing really. I, I enjoy all, all the music that uh, I buy. So, that's it. Question 10. A band, uh, a 19th recommendation. Okay, a 90 recommendation would have to be I believe um, um, Violator, just some pure thrash metal. Okay, uh, show a 7 inch that sold an album to you. Okay, and that would have to be Holy Grail. 
in proper burial. And I love the artwork on this one by Ed Remka. And this is, has two tracks, Fight to Kill and Immortal Man. And this was uh, a release from Holy Grail debut album, Crisis in Utopia, in Utopia, which came out in 2010. Okay, name an epic song, eight minutes or longer. Uh, oh, that's a great question. Uh, I would have to go with uh, Zappa Rock, a Spanish proto doom heavy metal band, uh, with their song La Gura Cool, and that's uh, that song runs for eight minutes and twenty two seconds. So if you haven't checked out this band and you like, love your proto do heavy metal, hard rock, Zappa rock, the four horsemen of the apocalypse. Okay. Um, question 14. A quick opinion on record store day. Okay, this question is uh, a good question. Um, I do not do Record Store Day, but I do uh, believe that it does help the uh, small record shops. Uh, so that's the only opinion I can give for Record Store Day. Uh, I don't uh, do it because there's nothing from, of my interest when it comes to Record Store Day, unless they bring out more heavy metal more metal records, then uh, I'll probably go. And also, uh, these Record Store Day uh, vinyl that are reissued or limited edition are quite expensive. So that's question 14. Okay, we go on to question 15. What part of your music setup would you change? Well, I would love to uh, get a new turntable a more better quality turntable probably a uh, CD uh, 10 CD rack dual tape deck basically a whole new uh, setup biggest musical disappointment of 2021 uh, uh, nothing really I'm pretty happy of what I'm hearing and seeing. Okay, question 17. Name an album expecting in 2022. Well, this is another great question. There's a lot of records that I want to get that are coming out this year. Uh, the New Violence, New Razor, New Exciter, New uh, Megadeth, New Anthrax, uh, New Toxic, New Saxon, and another hundred more records plus. Okay, who would you like to see release a solo record? Um, oh, that's a hard question. Uh, there are a lot of great um, singers and, around, but I would love to see a new... Rob Halford, probably. New Rob Halford solo album again, which he hasn't done for a while. So, yeah, I would say Rob Halford. Show a placeholder. Uh, I don't have it here, but uh, it would have to be uh, probably my two Ozzy Osbourne uh, solo albums, Blizzard of Oz and Diary of a Madman. The uh, record covers are split and uh, falling apart, so I'd love to get an update on those two albums. Okay, because of cost or availability, what album do you get to pick up? 
Well, I've just ordered uh, from my local record store uh, the uh, M16 Soda, the uh, UB Witcher. Also got uh, Forced coming and a few other records that I'm, I'm waiting for. So, yep, that's it for the 20 questions. Uh, I want to thank. The Rock Scout for uh, doing this smell tag it has been a good one. So if you haven't um, been involved, please do so. It's fun and, and um, it's very interesting to see what other VC members in the YouTube community are showing. So thank you for watching. Please stay safe, stay well, stay heavy. Bye for now.